Hello everyone, welcome back my designer days. I am Sin Fernando. Today I am going to show you how to celebrate Ostara or a festival of solar. When the length of the day and night are equal, it occurs between 19th March and 27th March, similar to Easter or New Year celebration and on at many part of country in the world. It was some traditional celebrate astrologically depending location and month of April too. The Pagana continue to celebrate the coming of spring. They attribute the change that are going on in the world to an increase in the power of their god and goddess. In the other words, the spring equinox, the sun shines directly on the equator and sun crosses the Celsius equator into the northern hemisphere from the southern hemisphere. It's called Ostara, spring equinox or vernal equinox. It is the first day of spring and has long been celebrated as a time of fertility, renewal, rebirth and beginning. If you are first time watch my video channel, don't forget to press bell icon and subscribe button. Download the video on my YouTube channel. The name Ostara, Easter, Estere, come from Germany, Norse, Irish, Saxon, Roman, Egypt. A point of perfect balance on the journey through the wheel of the air. Night and day are in equilibrium, dark and light, masculine and feminine, inner and outer, in balance. The natural world is coming alive, the sun is gaining in strength and warmer. It is time for the hope of Imbolc become action is fulfilled in the evident and abundant fertility of the earth at the star.
Once upon a time, the animal kingdom, collect together for a reunion in a flurry of great excitement. There was to be a very special party and a very special guest come and visit them. The very special guest was none other than the goddess herself, and everyone wanted to give her a special gift. Now some of animals were rich and some were very poor, but they want to prepare gift for only the very very best would do for the goddess. Hare was very excited. He dearly loved the goddess, and although he was very poor, he had a big generous heart. He was going to give her. the very finest gift he could find her rushed home to what he could find to give to goddess he looked everywhere in the house cupboards under the bed and larder but there was nothing to give her except for one thing on the shelf in the larder was the only thing he had left her gently took the egg out of larder and lovely decorate in and took it to the party her is very upset all the other animals gave their gift of gold silver and precious jewels and all her had been the egg eventually everyone has been given all the gift Her was the latest one. Her was very shyly presented the goddess with the egg. She took it and looked at him, and saw the true spirit of her. And there and then, goddess appointed her as her very special animal. because her had given away everything he had this is the story of her and goddess the goddess of stara has on the shoulders head of the har the symbols of stara In Celtic tradition the har is sacred to the goddess The egg contain a balance of male and female as sun and moon in the egg yolk and egg white So you can celebrate Ostara if you have place to prepare altar decorate with holy spring flowers daffodils cream roses violets crocuses celandine catkins and rosemary also leaves of beech ash and alder 
all foliage that this is putting into leaf. White feather, color of spirit water, and planting seeds spots. Decoration painted eggs, lighting candles, color of light green, yellow, light blue, pink, and purple, and similar colored ribbons too. You can have a beginner cake, bread with nuts, and hot cross buns. The hot cross buns have many relevant meaning for pagan sandwiches. They can represent the four elements of earth, air, fire and water or east, west, north and south while others say winter, spring, summer and autumn. Ostara is one of the eight Neopelan Sabbath that comprise the wheel of the year including Beltan Lamas or Lungsa, Lita, Mabon, Same, Yule, and Nimbolk. Wiccans, Pagans, Christian, Hindu, and other groups of religions celebrate in spring or new year each year as a spiritually rewarding practice, many parts of different countries in the world. Most Anglo-Saxon, Irish, Scotland, Mayans, Persian, Roman, Germany, American, Egypt, Indian, Chinese, Japanese, and more countries in the world. So now is the time to celebrate in the freshness of sun and moon as the source of our light and life force. Physically, we are experiencing life and taking the time to rise our energy to regenerate and abundance into something more beautiful beginning. Of time, our ancestors have marked this period with ritual and celebration. The return of the light presents us with an opportunity to take the time to release our fear and surrender into new intention for ourselves. Now is the time of celebrating the freshness of life and to and of taking the time to rise our energy to regenerate abundance and manifest our dreams. Activities of Ostara Bake with eggs, plant seeds, decorate your altar, sprinkle in your home, visit a farm or zoo to see baby animals, paint, dye, decoupage eggs, bake hot cross buns, make protection powder with eggshells.
sure to do something simple to honor your life in the next few days. Perhaps lighting candles and say a blessing. Also beautiful to have a picnic outside nature with your family members or friends. Have a nice time and enjoy. Happy spring, enchanted ones. Thank you for watching my video. Come back again. Bye-bye.